feeling good. I I came for time. I was running for time, and that's what I did. So. First time on this course. What What'd you know about going into it? How'd you prepare? Um, we didn't. We haven't been in this course before, obviously. So we just printed a lot of uh, the online course maps off. We ran the course beforehand. It was a it's a fun course. A lot of small uphills and downhills. So I like the course a lot. Heading into your sophomore season, what are your biggest goals? Is you set for you and coach set for yourself and everything? Uh, my main goal this season is to break 15 minutes. Uh, I, I last year I had a 15:39 as my PR. Uh, so I'm trying to not peak early in the season like I did last year and just uh, continually get better to, uh, throughout the season and hopefully get down below 15. What's a lot of your summer training been like? What's your mileage up to? Um, summer training, we've been running a little under 50 miles, 50 miles a week. Uh, summer training, we, we sort of started off slow because uh, last year we uh, we did way too much before uh, preseason. We yeah, ended up with near Woodbridge. So this year we decided to uh, back, back off on the summer training and just get really uh, hard training in at the beginning of the year and just keep going up. Oh yeah, we're, we're so excited. Um, we have our number one guy, Casillas. He's going to hopefully be running under 1430s this year. We have uh, me and Simon Opsall. Uh, we have a super deep team. We have like nine guys who could be varsity. So it's really looking to get this year and hopefully we can make state and even farther. Before postseason, is there any people that meet you guys are playing guards in a sense? Uh, well, we're going, to, we're going to Woodbridge, which is the main big meet we're going to. But other than that, it's just standard uh, league meet until, until final finals in the state, hopefully. Yeah, and then it's Drew. Race like this with a lot of people on the course, and you're using a lot of people actually. A lot of people cheering on. Yeah. How easy is it to get basically to stay in the race? Minimum? It's it was it was really nice because every few turns I would hear my dad screaming at me. I'd hear my coach yell my name. So I knew I, I was running for something, and it was it was easy to keep my mindset in the race.